Page 63, Deck the Halls. The top of the page, they're talking about playing a second voice in one hand, which means like a counter melody or something where there's two things going on and you're doing it all with one hand and you're not going crazy at the same time. Yeah. Well, let's take a look at what we got on here. Now, in uh, Deck the Halls, the second voice I believe they're talking about is in the right hand. Go down to the third line down. You have a whole note, C sharp, and then the, the, the melody is the top one. You have to hold that whole note down for the whole measure. It's like that's a bottom voice. It's like somebody is singing a harmony and they're going to hold that out. Next measure, it's a D, but it's a whole note, so hold it down for the whole measure. And then it's like the two voices now come together and they're singing in unison or singing the same notes. And now they're going to sing harmony again. It's very common. And then the last line, it's like only the first note is... is then the last two measures of the last line, the half note, make sure you hold it down. It takes a little practice to do it. And then again, hold it down and it's tied to the next measure. Like so, and then that. So it gets a lot more involved in that, but it gives you an idea that when you're seeing, like in the third line down, a whole note, and then you've got other stuff going on, you gotta hold that stuff down. Don't let it up, because we need to hear the we need to hear that sound. And that's really about all I can say. That it's got some crazy stuff in it. It's got you know, the rhythms. You can work out the rhythms if you just go the one and two and three and four and thing. This is back to common time. Now in this. You will see there are three sets of words going across, like in the first line, the first couple measures or so. Well, the first couple measures of every line, actually. So, the repeat doesn't tell you how many times to repeat. Typically, we would repeat one time and we're done. But when you have words in this, you're going to repeat as many times as you need to, so you cover all the verses, all the words. Now when we do the play with me section, I'm just going to repeat it one time. We're going to go through it twice. It's up to you if you want to do it on your own, have fun. You can sing all three verses if you want. The fingering, follow the fingering. It's, some of it's a little awkward, but it's okay. It's, I don't really know that another fingering is going to help you much, because I can trade one awkward fingering for a different one, but it doesn't help you any. So just use the fingering they're telling you to use. We're going to go really, really, really slow. It is repeated. We're going to play it twice. So let's try this out and see what happens. I'll give us four counts, and here we go. One, two, ready, go.